Hey yo YouTube, it is your boy Chris from Sonic Club and I have some brand new news to present to you guys today. So as you guys might have seen already, we just got the release date for Sonic Frontiers, but you guys have already seen that, so I'll talk about that briefly. But apparently, I just discovered an exclusive interview with Sonic Team head Takashi Izuka, and he just revealed to us when Sonic Prime will be released. Yes, yeah, Sonic Prime, remember that Netflix show that was accidentally leaked and then later confirmed? Other than all those screenshots that got leaked, we haven't seen anything about it. So fear not everybody, I have something brand new to present to you guys. Won't waste your time time as always let's roll the clip Okay, so let's get right into it. Remember that game we've been talking about? It's like an open world Sonic game. Apparently has some Breath of the Wild inspiration. I think it was just recently revealed. I can't remember what it's called. Yes, obviously Sonic Frontiers is what we were talking about. And we might have just gotten a release date leaked out. I don't know if you guys have seen this already. Most people probably already have. But we have a pretty reliable source that is relaying this information to us. So apparently, according to the PlayStation database, Sonic Frontiers will be releasing on November 15th of 2022. But yeah, I wanted to discuss this a little bit. So apparently this game is being released release in November and it doesn't really come as much of a surprise to me. Any Sonic fan knows that most games do release in the November December window. Typically as of late we see most 3D Sonic games come out in November though. So to see that it's coming out November 15th is that something that seems unrealistic? Absolutely not. I'm going to show you guys a tweet right here. This is from PlayStation Game Size and they specialize in going into the PlayStation database and finding out release dates for games and this is from the PlayStation database itself. It says Sonic Frontiers is coming November 15th 2022. Now it's not absolutely confirmed because nothing is confirmed unless you see a blue check mark with Sonic the Hedgehog, but something like this is very reliable. They did say it could possibly be a placeholder, but it is very unusual and very odd for a placeholder to have a specific date. Most placeholders would be the first of the month, the 31st of the month, and November 15th is a Tuesday, and I'm pretty sure like the last two Sonic games did get released on a Tuesday. So as far as I'm concerned, this seems pretty legit, and going forward, I'm going to assume November 15th as a release date for Sonic Frontiers. As you guys know, I'm very excited for this game. I think it's going to be great. Obviously, we'll hold our healthy level of skepticism, but as I've said a million times, this seems different, and we are less than a year away. Away. So what does this mean? Well, this means we're going to be getting gameplay very soon. If the game is 11 and a half months away, you can definitely expect gameplay sometime by March, possibly South by Southwest. I'm not really 100% sure, but to me, this indicates that we're getting gameplay pretty soon. I think Sonic Team is very confident in this product. We'll get into that a little bit later in the video. But yeah, going forward, let's assume that November 15th will be the release date for this game. It's not really too much of a surprise. They did say the holiday 2022 window is when they'll be releasing the game. So no matter what, we could have expected either November or December. Now, this is going to be coming out around the same time as breath of the wild 2 i did see a game journalist leak that breath of the wild 2 will be coming out in november of 2022 i mean nintendo hasn't really said anything officially yet so a little bit concerning because zelda obviously has a better track record than sonic but let's hold out hope i mean i feel like they're going in a completely different direction i'm excited for this game you should be excited for this game but let's talk about something that i found that's a lot more interesting than this so the release window for sonic prime has been officially confirmed by the man himself takashi izuka i discovered an exclusive interview with him he hasn't really been doing these as much back in the summer we were getting a lot of interviews from him but it's good to see that we finally have some official confirmed news i've been wanting to talk about sonic prime because we really haven't been seeing much about it low key super low key i feel like this is one of my most anticipated medias from sonic in 2022 there's a lot of crazy stuff happening it's so hard to pick which one's my favorite but this one is being slept on the last thing we really heard about sonic prime other than that it was confirmed for 2022 and it's going to be on netflix was the leaked concept art for it which looks really cool i mean this show can go a lot of different ways it seems like it's going to have a multiverse setting but we're also going to see modern Sonic animated for the first time in 3D. The last time we saw Sonic really interpreted faithfully was in Sonic X, and that's one of my all-time favorite Sonic forms of media. So I have a lot of high expectations for Sonic Prime, and not many are really talking about it. So if you've been feeding for Sonic Prime news, here you go. Here's the interview. Let's get right into it. Okay, so I found this on a Japanese website. The interview is written entirely in Japanese, so I was able to go over to Google Translate to translate this myself. So the translation might be a little bit rough, but this is the best that I got for you guys. This is probably the only place where you guys will see this for now it gives information about a lot of other japanese game developers but there's a quick little excerpt and in an interview from the man himself takashi izuka as you can see they start off by showing a little picture of him and our boy sonic the hedgehog and the title which translated from japanese to english says 2022 aspirations and the next part of the article translates to year of sonic's breakthrough as i was saying as we're all saying 2022 is the year of sonic looks like izuka is saying it himself but anyways let's continue reading here's the big translation it says last year 2021 was the 30th anniversary of sonic 
Sonic, and we have made various efforts, but we hope that this year, 2022, will be a year of further progress. The long-awaited sequel to the Sonic movie is scheduled to be distributed in the spring, and the new animation series Sonic Prime is scheduled to be distributed on Netflix in the fall. Okay, so that's the first time we've heard this. Sonic Prime looks like it will be coming in the fall. He then goes on to say the completely new Sonic Frontiers are being developed every day so we can deliver them. Please look forward to Sonic's success in 2022. You don't say. It looks like 2022 is the year of Sonic. Next part of the interview translates to recent reports. He says, did you see the video of Sonic Frontiers? The title still has many mysteries, but I think I was able to convey an atmosphere that is different from Sonic so far. We are working hard to create a title suitable for the year of the leap, so please look forward to the follow-up report. Okay, so once again, he says that this is going to be extremely different. He thinks he was able to convey an atmosphere in the trailer that just seems very different from what we've seen in the past, and that statement I can definitely not disagree with. And he says, look out for more news. So maybe we're going to get Sonic Frontiers news very soon. If the game is slated to release in about 11 months, I'm expecting stuff to come out fast. The next thing that is translated says what to look out for in 2022. Obviously, you guys know it's Sonic Origins, Sonic Prime, Sonic Movie, and Sonic Frontiers. And the response is a little bit weird. He says, while COVID-19 is still rampant in the world, we are paying attention to the growth of online distribution media. Unlike TV, it's amazing that an interesting work becomes a global hit in an instant. Recently, there are many interesting works that have taken a lot of time. So as typical with these interviews, he says a whole lot of nothing right there. But let's talk about the major piece of news that he just dropped subtly. No one has talked about this. I'm the only one that's seen this. So make sure to hit that thumbs up, hit that subscribe button, turn on the noti bell. You do not want to miss any Sonic news. Who else is really going on Google Translate for you guys? I'm going to pat myself on the back a little bit. I think this is a great place to be for pretty much anything Sonic. Anyways, so yeah, very crazy. This is the first time we've heard anything about Sonic Prime in a very long time. We now have an official release window for this. It's going to come out in fall of 2022. I'm a little bit sad about this because we're going to have to wait a very long time for this. So we're at least eight months away from Sonic Prime. So I'm expecting a trailer or something soon if it's going to be coming out in eight months. But now we have an official release window for Sonic Frontiers, Sonic Prime, and the Sonic Movie 2. Sonic Movie 2 is going to dominate the spring. Sonic Prime is going to dominate the fall and hopefully build up hype for Sonic Frontiers. And Sonic Frontiers will dominate the holiday window. So the last thing that we're looking for is Sonic Origins. Maybe it is still possible, although I think this game is going to be delayed, that we could see this in early 2022 before the movie. If we had Sonic in just about every quarter of 2022, that would be an amazing anniversary year to make up for the lack of content that we really got this year. But yeah, just to recap, we got Sonic Prime confirmed for the fall. Not many people are talking about this, so I want to advance the conversation about Sonic Prime. Are you excited for this? When do you think this is officially going to come out? If I had to guess, probably late September, because Izuka did say the main focus of this is to build up hype for the IP. They're not necessarily looking to make money, although I'm sure Netflix is paying them the bag. But yeah, I'm just super hyped for this Netflix show, as you guys can see by the screenshots. They can take this so many different ways. Maybe Sonic will visit himself in previous games. Apparently, it's going to stay somewhat consistent to the canon of the games. So in case you forgot about Sonic Prime, I'm putting it at the forefront of your brain. Please let me know in the comments everything about your thoughts, Sonic Prime. Let's further the conversation. So yeah, Frontier's release date has been officially leaked. We'll hold that with a grain of salt. Hopefully it will be confirmed as November 15th, maybe earlier. And we have Sonic Prime confirmed for the fall. So now the dominoes are falling into place. We finally have a realistic picture of when the release window will be for all the Sonic 2022 products, except for Sonic Origins. But since they're backloading the second half of the year, maybe Sonic Origins could come earlier. Anyways, I want to hear what you guys have to say. I'm turning the mic over to you. What are your thoughts about this crazy information? What do you think about Izuka's interview? Do you think we're any closer to getting Sonic Frontiers news? And when do you think exactly Sonic Prime will come? When would you want to see it come? Anyways, that's all I got for you guys. Please follow my Instagram, my TikTok, my Twitter. Join my Discord server. The links for all that is below. If you want to stay up with the latest Sonic news, please follow my channel. Please subscribe. Turn on the notification bell. I love you guys so much. I have nothing else to report to you guys. So until I see you guys next time, peace out.